get downhill whenever she wants. Here we go from Cameron Indoor, the Duke Blue Devils trying to bounce back after an ACC loss, early conference matchup against the Clemson Tigers on Thursday. Picks up her dribble, needs some help. She gets it in the form of Jefferson who has her shot blocked. Duke Blue Devils do that very well. And then in transition, Taina Mayer is fouled. Chance for the three-point play. Downhill getting easy touches and easy layups in the paint early in this game. And well, that's how you do it. And the answer on the other end from Antonucci. Ten on the shot clock now. Jefferson calling for it. Four points in the game for the Memphis transfer. Drive, make it six. Three on the shot clock now. Antonucci delivers. That was a great possession, not getting out of control. How quickly can these new players acclimate to the players around them and the new system that they're in? Yeah, for sure. I think the hardest thing as there was gets a look right there inside the paint. You just mentioned it. <laughs> a nice pickup and a nice transfer bucket right there. Ascended quickly in terms of the rankings coming out of high school. Went from unranked to number 27 in the course of spring and summer of 2022. This is second free throw, but you trade the one for three. Six to shoot. Dump off not happening. Steal taken away by O'Connell. She'll drive to the basket and get a chance for one more. 14 points in the game for Antonucci. Drive on the other end and a little emotion after the fact for Ashlyn Jackson. Yeah, you see Richardson on the, on the bench, Jaden Donovan on the bench, Kennedy Brown on the bench. So the starters here in the second half looking a little bit different. Jefferson had to go up and over three Blue Devils there. Couldn't do it. And then Duke, that's how you're on the floor. Yeah, that was uh, a bulk of Florida Gulf Coast points came from the free throw line in the first half. Good block there from Ozudu. She'll take the three. And Duke is really forcing them to play outside of their comfort zone as Reagan Richardson gets the last night set there from and get some three-point makes if they want to win this one. Mayer lines it up from three. We'll win this one easily. 82-63, our final from Cameron Indoor. Yeah, really good outing for Duke. I know they have to be happy with a comeback. 